often a good score, as we know. Jim, an alternate shot. You know it well. Absolutely. Celine Boutier is here. Trip Eisenhower's with this group. Good looking shot right there. Wow, is that any good? Only three birdies today. That's a good chance for four. Left, but uh, I think this one's going in. I think you're right. They birdied two, three, and now seven. So they're three under. Good start for them. It's into three under par through seven. So have I have a feeling <laughs> it's part of the cunning plan. Okay. Here is Karis Davidson of Australia teaming up again this year with Ecuador's Daniela Darkea. They're at the 14th. Got a front hole location here, and her partner's going to make her partner quite happy. This is Ration Lu at the 10th, playing with Yu Lu, no relation, both from China. Like this. This was a moment ago, Daniela Darkea for birdie. Yeah. This was a big week for them last year. It helped Darkea move up in the reshuffle. She wound up finishing second in Portland that year and kept her card. 64 leads the way, alternate shot. Whole location on the back portion of the green, just have to be a little bit aware not to go long. Very nice, Jim, how they mowed the, the lines on that tee so you can mm. kind of get yourself set up perfectly. Ah, what there a you shot. Go, Jane. Yeah, absolutely. Wonderful play right there. Yeah, give them a good chance for birdie. <laughs> All right, at the 10th, after the approach from Ration Lu, this is Yu Lu. Anything under par and alternate shot is, uh, well, you'll, well, you'll take it for sure. Nice putt there. Gets them back to even par. Straight, maybe left edge, left center. Got a break, yeah. Ah, just didn't have the speed. Got it out there a little too far, but disappointing because it's, it's such a good shot in there. It's all part of it. Just a tricky little putt coming down the slope. I used to love greens that, that you had to do that on. You know, we had to pick. That's not her normal routine. Yeah, that's the result. Just never looked like she could commit to it or never did. Or four for Karen Chung. Who's going to have a long putt for a birdie? That is true. Yeah, about 12 feet, not what you would expect from 102 in the right in the fairway. But again, Jim, this club can fix all sorts of ails. Just what the doctor ordered. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> exactly. You kind of feel like you're responsible, though. Like if you fit it over the back of the green, you feel like you have to make it up to your partner by making that putt. Yeah. Connections here. You've got the college. Ties here, like with Chang and Chung from USC, the Americans. And that was for birdie for Jennifer. 
Back at the 12th. Comeback birdie putt for you lose. So she drove the green. She made the comebacker. And Ration says, so we, we made birdie there, right? The two of us. Yeah. <laughs> That's how you do it. It's a team. But I only hit one. You hit two. All right, here is Yusang Ho at the 14th. Just turned 24 on Monday. Snapping at it. Oh, and Money Chen loves it. Have they been working on... Look at this. Uh, this is... No, they know what they're doing. <laughs> From Chinese Taipei. And back to even par after a wobbly second hole. Yes. And... Yeah, it is. It is. As Karen said, the, the problem is sometimes you just get so tentative because you don't want to leave that extra putt for your partner. But that's how you do it. There's no extra putt there. Sasa with a par save at nine. The birdie putt to get the thumbs up from Celine Boutier, her teammate. They're within two of the lead. It's alternate shot day one of this team event. All right, Boutier now. Let's check out her shot with our top tracer technology presented by Progressive Insurance. Now it looks like she's got six iron. I think you know, Ryan just said Georgia probably hit seven. That's why she's short. She's over on that left side. Tells me she's maybe trying to get a little bit of a draw. Well, that tracer's got to be looking pretty good, Jim. I'd say a little draw. Well, that'll work. Good chance for birdie for both teams here. It's a crossover to 18. And Gina Kim for birdie. She's the, the Duke pairing. Yeah. With Jarvi Boonchan, who played so well last week. So now for birdie. Breaking to the right, Jim. And again, you know, her speed has been pretty good. Really flat putt, though, so shouldn't be an issue. It was on that one. So they make. And just a moment ago, up ahead at 14, this is the rookie, Aline Crowder. There you go. There you go. Okay. From Stanford, playing with Ines Laklalesh, another rookie. All the way up the hill now, Megan's downhill, a little right to left. Wow. Wow. Paula couldn't missed. believe it. Yeah. yeah, that's a that's a missed opportunity there, Grant.
college golf at Texas A&M, two-time All-American for Garrett Chadwell. That just happens to be Stacy Lewis's husband. They've been there for a couple of years. He's done a great job at A&M. Nice putt there. They needed something to get going. Yeah, I thought this was going to be a pretty solid pairing. Mm-hmm. Um, so obviously the formats got them a little bit on the on the back foot at the moment, but yeah, heartless. Second shot for Celine Boutier at 14, 102 yards. Oh boy, I just don't see coming up that far short. No, they're all trying to be so perfect. Land it, the flag, and get it to spin back. 17. Yep, you Lou now. Second shot in here. Whole location 10 steps on. Four from the right. Should spin. Does nicely. Yeah, good chance playing 363 today. Kind of maybe a little bit downwind. So they'll have a good chance for Birdie. For Sasso at 14. The silly error, really. Makes up with her. The reverse happened at nine, right? Yep. Mm-hmm. Sasso missed it with a wedge and made the par putt. And I think she's saying, okay, we're even. Lou. Yep, Ray Shin Lou now for birdie. You Lou hit a beautiful shot into this to get the minus four. Big time putt there. Nice. Yeah. Way to go, partner. <laughs> Thumbs see, up. This is, this is what this format is so fun. Like, you get to see personalities of players yep. that you wouldn't normally see. Like, she wouldn't be that excited for herself if she'd made that chunk of change 15 it's all about perspective grant you Sasso now second shot well that needs to get down that's right oh my yeah it is it will be on the up slope but it's quite a steep slope that one too jim par as we go to 15 yeah third shot for boudier yeah jim this team's had a lot of wedges and it made i know they hadn't made any bogeys but my goodness they're making it hard on themselves at times mm, they got some work to save par here I think the tee shot by Yulu was uh, a little bit cautious with the water on the uh, left side of that flag. Caution an alternate shot is maybe not the, they go the worst idea, hand. is it? Exactly. I mean, they're they're doing great. Don't get me wrong, but they could be doing really, really good. Yeah, one was long, one was short, one was right, but there's a par. And they're getting away with it, so hats yeah. off to them. Yeah. They've been making those putts when, they, when they've had to. Yeah. Stats yeah. don't lie. Yeah, yeah. stats don't lie. Mm-hmm. They're facts. Nice birdie there. Get some one back. Just one over now. Par at 18. Five birdies and a bogey, Karen. An alternate shot. That's pretty solid. I think they'll take it. They teamed up at the International Crown back in May, and a nice start to the Down Great Lakes Bay Invitational. Consistent all day, and and now it seems to be blowing kind of steady for the last I don't know 25 minutes. I'd like to follow Ryan O'Toole's ball right down the right center of this gr- of this hole. Well, now that's even better than that. Mm-hmm. Put Celine in a great spot here. Hey, you can say that again. 162. Oh boy. That is another really unforced error. Would it surprise you to hear that there have been two birdies at 16 today? <laughs> no, it's a it's a long haul. It's a good a tough one. Third shot at 16 for Sasso. Uh, if they can stay bogey free here. Wow. Oh, well, that was textbook this isn't match play if it were that'd be cons- comes out nice yeah. that was just a moment ago but it still went in either way looked like a birdie all the way too <laughs> yeah, she put me in the perfect spot yeah. she said gotta take another look at that nicely releases through it boop yeah it was moving up for an ahead for bogey. And she really 
just caught it perfectly. This team have been scrambling up a storm. And I've realized that, wait a minute, I'm not the only one out here mm. playing. You're not on an island on your own. That is Boudier on the tee at 17. Do you feel that, Jim, when you played? Yeah, I mean, I, I think it was the like the alternate shot. The, the, that was a little bit unnerving at first, but then once you get... Oh, I think we can. Yeah. Needs a spin. Okay, that'll work. Good, good, shot. good chance for birdie. Yeah, that. I want the green. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she's proud. She's are you happy. proud of me? She, she hit a green with a wedge. That's... Are you proud? Are you proud of me? She said. <laughs> Everybody's proud of you. Skipping on down. Only 22. Yeah. <laughs> Celine Borga now for birdie here. They're having a great day. This is her finishing the round, and did she? Yes, she did. What a good start. Everybody's happy. Holly Max happy. Everybody's happy. That gets him to shoot 65. Great round. Great opening round. This would be a great par if she could make this putt. There you go. You're picking up ground on the field with a par. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> this as well. No doubt about it. And you know, she's actually been partnered with Georgia Hall quite a mm -hmm. quite a few times. That's true. So it's probably quite strange for them to be playing this format not together. I think we're going to see that this fall, don't you, Karen? I think we're going to see that again for sure. <laughs> <laughs> Got to try and dial this one in. <laughs> yes, it has, Karen. <laughs> This one's going to be pretty good, though. Mm, two in a row. Yeah. She smiles again. Yeah. Happy at her partner. <laughs> She's dialed in now she that they're done. She sounds so surprised. Yeah. I hit another green. Yeah. <laughs> and that's going to be a putt for a 65. Now second shot. This is from 103. These are the kind that you just feel like you could take dead aim at the whole location oh that was just a moment ago but it's still a great shot beautiful well played okay they needed that one and you kind of get the feeling that if those two could have played part for the birdie not much in this one. All right, nice shot in there. They get a birdie as they head to 18. There you go. That looks good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, they had fun. Yes, they did. Even when... They uh, had the occasional errant wedge. That is a bogey-free 65. They're one back. They're at even par. Boy, that sounded like great contact. And it is. Oh, well, that was textbook. Great way to finish. <laughs> there you go, 69. Make the evening a little bit better. Good way to finish there at one under par 69. Castron and Tan, 64. One shot lead over three others. Worth the Dow Great Lakes Bay Invitational, Midland, Michigan. Some great scores out there. We'll be right back.